Hi, I'm Becky Wright, Managing Director of Perform, and today I'm joined by Alex Dafina, the founder of Perform, and we're going to be discussing the training program that we have here at Perform. So Alex, um, could you start by explaining a little bit about what FST is? Sure. So FST is basically our signature training program. It's about trying to take complicated science to the layperson, I mean, unless you're you know, a strength and conditioning expert or a nutritionist, and this is kind of like your bread and butter. The world of exercise science can be really difficult to understand for most people. And we recognize that there's a lot of women who are really interested in their health and fitness, yet they struggle to get the results because they simply don't have the programming expertise on their side. And unfortunately, a lot of businesses don't either. A lot of coaches are too busy to try to make the workout fun or exciting um, and not actually putting that, that sort of science and applying that to how they're actually gonna program these clients and get results long term. And it's very easy to get a result in the short term by just doing something, but to get the best possible result in terms of burning body fat, building lean functional muscle, building strength and balance in the body is a bit of an art form and something which after you know, almost 4,000 women, um, I think that we can be sort of humbly assured that we've kind of nailed it in terms of the sequencing of that programming. Sure. So FST stands for Female Specific Training. Um, obviously it's tailored specifically to women. Why is it that women should be training differently to men? Sure. I mean. It really does boil down to a, a hormonal differential. There's a big spectrum of women and there's a big spectrum of men, but really if you want to cut that line down the middle and say how do women respond differently to training to men, it could be um, their ability to hold a higher intensity under a higher percentage of a maximal load for a longer period of time, uh, it could be how the recovery uh, differential between a testosterone versus an estrogen balance in the body on, from metabolic conditioning, but to, to not go down the rabbit hole for a second, there is a pretty fundamental difference between how women and men respond to training and therefore how we actually stress the body to get the response has to be different if we're going to get the best possible result. Okay, so at Perform, what are some of the training classes that you have on offer that encompass the FST program? Sure, sure. We've got a wide range of classes. I mean, we do 16 classes a day here in Hong Kong, um, but we've, you know, some of the classes like a Rev, which is our spin class, our Rumble, uh, which is our kickboxing our uh, yoga, these styles of classes don't have as much of a concern on the recovery as our more heavy duty classes. They're still very, very important, but not as important in terms of how we actually facilitate the recovery as our heavy classes. And so those, those other classes, we basically got orbit, two types, high intensity interval and strength, which is a circuit based class, uh, lift, which is our heavy lifting uh, classes, uh, ignite, and so with these classes, and sorry, Sculpt, and Sculpt is our body part specific, all of them really fall into this sort of perfect equilateral triangle of the secret recipe in terms of actually facilitating the best possible result. So you're gonna have a neurological stress, which is the lift and orbit strength, has a hormonal adaptation, upregulation of sex hormones, thyroid hormones, growth hormones, and so on. We have a metabolic uh, stress, which is basically testing the different energy pathways of the body, um, creating EPOC, which is a long-term fat burning over two to three days, and a cellular stress, creating shape to the body, but also creating function to the body. If you can, you know, if you, whilst you're working on your glutes to get that tutti fruity booty, you're also learning how to actually activate the butt better, which is gonna to correlate to you know, better squats and, and, and more balance in the body. And the problem is most people don't have that approach. They're not looking at all three equally and how you actually you know, se sequence those, um, those modalities throughout the week. Awesome, okay, so um, the FST program, is it suitable for all women or you know, sure. should there be some who don't do this? There would probably be two types of people that I would say this is not the best possible program for. Those types of people would be top level professional athletes that can only dedicate their time to sports specific training. An equestrian rider, a volleyball player, you know, a professional MMA athlete. Those people might need very nuanced, very specific training relevant to an outcome in the next upcoming competition. The other people would be people who don't like working out that hard. And so whilst we're not actually trying to make everyone have, you know, you know, collapse in a heap, we do want to push intensity across all those variables. So if you're doing a bicep curl, how do you get the maximum amount of peak contraction in the bicep? If you're doing yoga, how do you really go into those movements and actually you know, activate each part of each muscle according to the pose? If you're doing a Metcon, how do you train until your heart feels like you, you, know, you might have a heart attack? 
We want to push these things relatively hard because the harder we can push it with intelligence behind the programming, the best possible result. So unless you just want to train um, and have one degree north of arrested state, which is, mm -hmm. I think everyone understands you need to do something to get a result, or you're a top level elite athlete training very specific to your next competition, the other 99.9% .9 of people, 100% will not get a better result under any other kind of program that I'm aware of. Awesome, so it's intelligent programming plus that intensity that gets the awesome results. And in a fun environment at the end of the day, turning up and training with your friends and the coaches who know you, respect you, want to serve you is ultimately how we actually get that and, and come in consistently day by day, moving forwards with some science on our side. Yeah, amazing. I couldn't agree more. Thank you so much, Alex. Thanks, Becky. Um, so hopefully that's uh, given you a little bit of an insight into our FST program. And we really hope to see you in Perform soon to join us in a class.